Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Let's Play FB Games and we are back with some more WWE 13 Attitude Era mode. We're still on the rise of DX. We've still got quite a bit to complete. We've got five more things to do. And the next one is, as you can see, you guys will know this. Shawn Michaels versus Bret Hart, November 9th, 1997, Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Survivor Series is the show. You guys know what this match is. If you're a true wrestling fan, you'll know what happened in this match. If you're not, then you're about to find out. The long and bitter rivalry between Shawn Michaels and Bret Hart would eventually come to an end, but no one expected to the way it did. This match is not only one of the most important moments of the Attitude Era, but one of the most important moments in WWE and wrestling history. So let's get into it. I think there's a video, so let's listen to it. Bret Hart and Shawn Michaels were polar opposites. From the beginning, the groundwork was laid for a fierce rivalry. I just want to say one thing, Shawn Michaels, I can promise you for 60 minutes, you were in for the absolute worst pounding of your entire life. The historic Iron Man match did nothing to settle their issues. In fact, it only fueled the fire. Just because I choose to live my life openly and freely does not make you a better man. As the taunting unfolded, their bitter feelings intensified. But a degenerate, you know, arrogant, pompous guy I've ever seen. I thought I could do it. You way out, you me. You'd like to hit me, but you, you don't have the insights to do it. And this year is what it's all about. And until you have this, you will never, ever, ever be the showstopper. Bret Hart, you are a zero, my hero. I'm gonna kick your little scrawny ass. A story full of twists and turns saw Bret Hart's contract negotiations become the focal point of what would become their final encounter. Everybody just keeps turning up my guy. You keep turning up my guy. Everybody in that dressing room knows that I'm the best there is, the best there was, and the best there ever will be. Well, the final encounter between Brett the Hit My Heart and Shawn Michaels the Heartbreak Kid. <sighs> the ending to this is surprising to me. Why have we got a loading screen? Oh. Well, what business is it going to be? What business are we going to have? No, I'm fine! Anyway, guys. Win by pinfall or submission, and we've got a hidden objective. So... We're going to see the loading screen again. So many loading screens, guys. Oh, by the way, I was just, uh, my mum was asking me if I wanted to go out to the beach with my family, but recording, so, can't, 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 can't. So there you go, guys, you can see it all again, we've got a win by pin, got a win by pinfall submission, got a hidden objective. My parents are showing up to my sister, I think. Not just because they're showing up to me, I don't know. But anyway, loading in. Most premier athletes in the history 
of the WWE are moments away from locking up right here in Montreal. Ah, oh, this is what it's all about. How many times have we heard Shawn Michaels say he won't lay down for anybody? And how many times have we heard Bret Hart say he's the best there is, the best there was, and the best there ever will be? Well, it's time to put up or shut up. One of them will put up, and the other will be shut up. There you go. Here comes the WWE Champion. Bret Hart is going crazy. He's in his hometown. Well, he's in his home country. Little does he know what's about to happen to him. Shawn Michaels knows, but Bret Hart doesn't. And the crowd going absolutely ballistic for the hitman. I just, I just realised if Shawn Michaels wins today, he'll become a double champion. He'll be the European champion as well as the WWE champion. Facts with Kami. So, let's go underway with the final encounter between these two in a few seconds. As referee, Little Nate, holds up the WWE Championship. For everyone in Montreal to see, I am starving. <laughs> I might get something to I will get something to eat after this, I'm really hungry. But anyway, Shawn Michaels and Bret Hart. The final encounter between these two. Shawn Michaels going for a near fall. Win by pinfall submission, we've got a hidden objective. I'm not sure when we unlock got a hidden objective. It doesn't give us any warning or any notice or anything. So I guess we just got to beat down Bret Hart. What? How was I stunned from the... I don't know. I don't know how I got stunned from that, but okay. Working on the arm now is Bret. And catching Bret with a crossbody. Elbow to the heart. Well, to the ribs, maybe. To the stomach, to the chest area. There we go. I'm sorry, guys. I'm all over the place. And a back suplex from Brett. What? It's Vince McMahon. I just realised my phone doesn't have much battery left. And it's Vince McMahon. Okay. It's Vince McMahon. By God, please don't, Mike. Uh, please don't, Brett. Don't, don't, Brett. Brett, we had an agreement. Well, you weren't involved in it, but me and Mr. McMahon and Triple H had an agreement before this match that you would not hurt me. So don't hurt me. You got that? Michaels is fighting, fighting hard. Atomic drop. Now looking for a submission move, maybe. Just wearing down Bret Hart, and Bret Hart is going to fight out of it, because he is the hitman, he is the WWE champion. Off the ropes comes Michaels, and a spinning net breaker. And Bret Hart reverses. Michaels wrenching the arm too. And another float of a neck breaker by HB Shizzle. And Bret Hart slamming Michaels out of the corner. Off the ropes again comes Michaels. And a flying forearm attempt missed. Bret Hart get out of the way, the flying forearm.
Brett. Brett hits a net break on Michaels and Michaels could be down for the count here. Elbows now to the back of the head of Michaels. Another flow of a net breaker. Okay, I remember what the hidden objective is now. I remember what the hidden objective is now. I'm not going to say it to you guys because I don't want to ruin the match. But Scorpion Death Drop by Michaels. Is he going to go for another one? No, back suplex instead. No, my bad, Atomic Drop. And now up top, Michaels, Moon Salt. One. Oh, Brett kicks out. Now, Michael's taking out the leg. Michael's with the reversal. And now it looks like Michael's could just be going with a straight vertical suplex here. Telling Brett to suck it. Because Michael's knows what's going to happen. Brett doesn't. If you guys haven't read about the history of this match, go read it. Oh, watch this video, it's up to you. It's your, your choice. Just taking Brett down. This has been a brutal match so far. Michael's just repeating the same move. A final time. Into a cover. And Brett is fighting back very well here. Is there no disqualifications? I didn't know there's no disqualifications. Maybe it is, but I'm not going to risk it in case. Maybe it is no disqualifications and Law is lying to me. I don't know. It just said, Jerry Law just said it was no disqualifications, so I'm not entirely sure. In fact, I can't remember. I've, I thought this match was just a straight singles match. There's a back suplex. And now Michaels. Crossbody. And now. Knee drop. Fuck's sake. How did you miss that when you landed perfectly? Probably hear me spamming in. I apologise for that, but. You know. Shit, shit happens. And. Vertical suplex. How has Michaels not got a signature yet? Okay, now he does. And now, Michaels with a sharpshooter. I'm not sure what an objective is. I'd really like to know though. Alright, we'll do a super kick. We won't do a super kick. Okay, what's happening? What are we doing? Why are we going to the outside? Okay, Brett, you're confusing me. No. What's happening? Brett. Brett, are you fully dumb? Brett just decided to go walk about. That's cool. I guess. A bread with a bulldog. Have I got to wear him down more or something? I'm not sure. Brett, can you not? <laughs> oh, he's got steps. Okay, if he hits me with them, it's okay. Actually, no, I'm not going to risk it. Okay, I must need to wear him down a bit more then, because he's only on yellow. Can't believe I've worn him down, he's still only on yellow. Brett, I'm going to have to fucking take matters into my own hands in a minute. Alright, you understand? Oh, great. Face first goes Michaels. Stop escaping, just get in the, stay in the ring or stay out of the ring. It's up to you. Just don't try to escape me. Brett, you're not going to do anything. Oh, my God. 
Okay, Brett's taking Michaels back into the ring, but Brett's still on the outside. I do it. Just taunt. Come in then. Yeah, damn right. Stay down. Perform the perform the sharpshooter on Brett. Okay. That that can happen. That can that can be done. You just bear with me. Oh, that should keep him down enough, long enough for me to turn my way to signature. Why have I not got signature? Lefez pressed by Michaels, busting up and Brett. Another sharpshooter by Michaels. What's happening here? Vince McMahon rings the bell. Both men questioning Vince McMahon and Bret Hart spitting on him. Michaels will take it. W C W and Bret Hart has been screwed out of the title. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's all for part five of my Attitude Era mode playthrough. We've got another bonus match we can do at another time. But anyway, guys, my phone's about to die. Hope you guys have enjoyed. I'll see you next time when we do this tag team match. Bye for now.